Are you Melikar? Oh, aye, that's me. I need to speak with the prisoner. And why is that? Who might you be? Henry, envoy of Saradze Kobola. I'm here to investigate the attack. I'm sorry. I have other things on my mind right now. In case you hadn't noticed, we have pestilence raging here. And Saradzig won't help us with that any more than he helped us when we were attacked. No news has reached Ratai of any disease here. But I'm here now, and I can help you. Hmm. Well, since you serve Saradzig, you might be of some use. If anyone can be. Tell me what to do. There's a stable hand living with us here, Matthias. Yes, I know him. And he knows some girl who helps out in the monastery infirmary. Your hanker, I think her name is. She might know someone to turn to, if she's actually there. Very well. I'll go to the monastery. It's probably our best hope. Thank you. At least for taking the trouble. But then, even if you cared nothing for us, the prisoner's got the pestilence too. He'll die without help. If I have to go to the monastery, I need to know as much as possible about the disease. I'll definitely need to know its symptoms. They're bound to ask me that. It's hard to say. My wife is feverish. Others have the chills. I heard some are throwing up. Others still are breaking out in sores. But why don't you see for yourself? People talk a lot and I don't know what to believe anymore. Very well. I'll make the rounds. I've daubed lime on the afflicted houses. But don't stay too long in those homes. <laughs> that I can promise you. Your hanker? Uh, Henry? I'm glad to see you. Me too. I heard that you're doing well. Not right now. Matthias sent me. Matthias? My God, did something happen? I don't know if you've heard about it, but Merhoyev was attacked. Oh God! How is Another Matthias? Is Wounded in the arm. He's being brave about it, but his injury looks bad. I need to see him. Before you go, there's something else. What? Some kind of disease has taken hold in Merhoyed. Their livestock has died off, and now the people are coming down with it too. I thought maybe someone here might know what to do. Merciful heavens. How awful. It's a good thing you've come here. If there's any hope, this is the place to find it. You need brother Nicodemus, the monastery physician. He may know how to deal with it. Very well. I'll try to find him. Come back when you know more. Thank you, Johanka. You're the one who's in charge of the wounded. Yes, I'm the infirmarius here. Time was I only had a few elderly monks who couldn't walk to take care of. Now I have this mess to deal with. Monks so old they can't hold themselves up with their own legs. Oh, if that were the only bodily function they could control. But I shouldn't talk like that. It's a blessing to live to such an age. Some kind of disease has taken hold in Merhoyed. Your hanker said that you might be able to advise. A disease, you say? How intriguing. Yes, yes, it's very interesting. But can you help these people? I can't say at this point. I need to find out a little more. Tell me, has the whole village come down with it? No, I mean, not yet. Several households have, around half the village. Merhoyed? Isn't there a stud farm there? And what of the animals? Did they get infected too? Yes, there's a stud farm. And they've all died off. The horses, the cattle, chickens, and now it's got to the people. That is most intriguing. What are we to do about it? Do you know the symptoms? Yes, more or less. Excellent. I have several extensive volumes here in the library. Describe the epidemic, including the symptoms, and we could take some guidance there. Can you read? Yes, I can. Excellent. So follow me to the scriptory.
think I have it. Yes? And what do you make of it? It's poisoning from tainted water. Really? That sounds rather unlikely. But if Master Johann of St Paul's says so, who am I to contradict him? We shall have to prepare some medicine at once. I could help with that. Really? Yes. I know my way around the alchemistic arts. An ordinary fellow who knows the arts of physic? Who would have thought it? Excellent. I'll give you the recipe. And you have my permission to make use of the monastery laboratory. I'll get started right away. I, meanwhile, shall head straight to... Uh, where was it again? Merhoyed. Oh, yes, Merhoyed. I'll take your hanker with me. She has no equal in caring for the sick. Once you have the medication ready, hurry after me. Thank you, Brother Nicodemus. Good luck, Brother Nicodemus. And to you, Henry. We. Oui. So, here I am. How are things looking? It doesn't look good at all, my boy. Do you have the potion? Yes, here it is. I'll take four doses, you take the rest and let's split up. I'll see to the straw family while you deal with Melikar's wife and the rest. They wouldn't let me go near that prisoner. They want him to suffer. Despite his terrible crimes to treat a fellow mortal soul like that. Perhaps I'll be able to convince them. I promised I'd bring them help, and I've kept my word. They must let me go to him. I hope so, but in the short while I've been here, I've found the locals to be rather stubborn. You're back? Yes, and I have something to make you well again. Good Lord, of drink this and give it to everyone in the house. I've also brought someone who will take care of you until you get back on your feet. Thank you, good Samaritan. <laughs> Jesus Christ be praised. I brought some help, as promised. Will you let me see the prisoner? I will let you, I will. Of course I will. My boy, if you've really brought a potion to rid us of this scourge, I'll let you do anything. Ah, whether I've managed to rid you of the scourge, that remains to be seen. 
It'll take a few days before we know whether the potion worked. I know, but even so, just the fact that someone cares, that means a lot to us. Don't fret about that, Melikar. A thing like that would have scared anybody. Just take care of, um, what is your wife's name? Hannah. So, take good care of her. Now open up that shed. <laughs>